Welcome to Daily Scripture Reading. I do not own the rights to this music. Jeremiah chapter 39, beginning at verse 1 and ending at verse 10. This is the English Standard Version. The Fall of Jerusalem In the ninth year of Zedekiah, king of Judah, in the tenth month, Nebuchadnezzar, king of Babylon, and all his army came against Jerusalem and besieged it. In the eleventh year of Zedekiah, in the fourth month, on the ninth day of the month, a breach was made in the city. Then all the officials of the king of Babylon came and sat in the middle gate, Nergal, Sar, Ezer of Samgar, Nebu, Sar, Sikim, the Rab, Saris, Nergal, Sar, Ezer, the Rab, Mag, with all of the rest of the officers of the king of Babylon. When Zedekiah, king of Judah, and all the soldiers saw them, they fled going out of the city at night by way of the king's garden, through the gate between the two walls, and they went toward the Arabah. But the army of the Chaldeans pursued them and overtook Zedekiah in the plains of Jericho. And when they had taken him, they brought him up to Nebuchadnezzar, king of Babylon, at Riblah, in the land of Hamath, and he passed sentence on him. The king of Babylon slaughtered the sons of Zedekiah at Riblah before his eyes, and the king of Babylon slaughtered all the nobles of Judah. He put out the eyes of Zedekiah and bound him in chains to take him to Babylon. The Chaldeans burned the king's house and the house of the people and broke down the walls of Jerusalem. Then Nebu Zaradan, the captain of the guard, carried into exile to Babylon the rest of the people who were left in the city, those who had deserted to him and the people who remained. Nebu Zaradan, the captain of the guard left in the land of Judah some of the poor people who owned nothing and gave them vineyards and fields at the same time. The end. God bless you and thank you for joining me today.